So what my girl reports got today, is it me or is Zatan being relocated to Russia for the 2020 season? <laughs> Hello there guys, my name is Coach Shadong Stubborn, bought Built for Theme Park News. Before we get started, let's um, take you guys around the past few days then. So we've had plenty of news updates. I said a few days ago that I'd bring this video out during the week, uh, and here it is. This is a news update from Russia's Golden City, um, and the possible uh, new coaster for 2020, Russia's tallest coaster, uh, or Russia planning the tallest coaster in Europe sometime. Um, so... Basically, make sure you go check out our videos over the last few days. We've done some updates on Dejure Summerland, Dreamworld Australia, Knott's Berry Farm. So much new updates uh, for you guys to check out. Make sure you go check out the other videos we uploaded over last week, uh, like the four maze walkthroughs from Halloween. I want to try and get one more Halloween event in before the end of the Halloween season, uh, so I'll try my best to get out there. Um, I don't think it's going to be Scarefest, even though I'd love to. I, I, well, I'll try. Um, Scare Grounds in Wakefield, again, can't promise anything, but I'll try um, to try and get one more Halloween event in. Not one of the family ones, but I mean like one of the Scare Mates ones. So, uh, I'll try my best to get one in at some point uh, soon. Um, but, here we go then. So, basically, this is a theme park news update from Russia's Golden City. Um, and basically, the news article, uh, basically, it all started last year when it was coming out about these rumours about Europe's tallest coaster coming to Russia. And then, of course, uh, recently it came out that uh, some Google Earth pictures were shown in a forum. It's the Coaster Force forum. Make sure you go and check it out um, if you want to see those pictures. Basically, it was a Google Earth picture, and it looked like Zatan supports and track on, on like the site in Google Earth. Uh, well, according to Roller Coaster Database, it seems like... We could be seeing that true. Now, for those of you who don't know uh, what the hell I'm talking about, basically, Zatan uh, is an Intamin Accelerator Coaster uh, that opened at Space World. Um, basically, Space World uh, in Japan. Uh, it's a defunct theme park. It closed back in 2017, the 31st of December 2017, so it never made it through to 2018. Uh, and Zatan was one of the main coasters there. It had a height of 205.3 feet, uh, a drop of 197.6 feet, uh, a length of 1,313.3 feet, and a speed of 80.3 miles per hour, uh, with blue track and white supports. Now, of course, the rumor states that that could be going to Golden City for the 2020 season. But looking at um, the Europe's tallest coaster uh, record, um, this 205 so feet doesn't exactly meet the tallest coaster in Europe because the tallest coaster in Europe is 367.3 feet, which is Red Force at Ferrari Land, followed by Hyperion, followed by Shambhala, followed by Joint Fourth Place Silver Star and Kanan, uh, followed by Big One, followed by Zadra, and then it would go in seventh above Stealth. Uh, and then that would be the hyper coaster, and then Stuntfall, and then that would push Wildfire at Colmarden outside the top 10 tallest coasters in Europe. So again, it's pretty interesting. Um, it, it, I think with the article rumours, I think it's either the information doesn't match, or they reverse to a different plan and decide to go with just a really tall coaster for Russia. Now, of course, RCDB might change stuff, uh, when new stuff gets announced, but at the minute, all we know is on Rollercoaster Database, there's an unknown coaster coming to 2020, uh, reportedly relocation of Zatan. We were wondering where that would go. Uh, Zatan and Kanonen at least, but those were the two main accelerator coasters we had at home. Obviously, Kanonen's in storage at Lost Island Water Park. Is that going to be part of their brand new theme park plans? Make sure you go check out that news update that we did on the new Lost Island theme park plans by the Lost Island water park owners uh, with the possibility of Kanonen being in those plans. Um, but Zatan was another accelerator coaster we didn't know the long-term future of after Space World closed just a couple of years ago. Uh, and the rumour is that that is going to be going to a park called Golden City, which is in Russia. Um, now, again, it... it Again, the news article information could be wrong. It won't. It, it may not be the tallest coaster in Europe, but if Zatan is coming uh, to uh, Russia, 
I think, even though it's not going to be the tallest coaster in Europe, I think it's going to be a great addition to the park. I think it's going to be a perfect addition to the park. I think it will really help uh, the park become an even more success. Uh, so I think it's a good move, even if they don't get the tallest, the actual tallest coaster in Europe. Um, now I think with the information possibly saying it is the tallest coaster in Europe, that says to me that it might not even be the relocation of Zaton. It could be a new accelerator coaster from scratch that is taller than Red Force at Ferrari Land at Port Aventura. So there's a possibility here that it could either be Zaton or it could be a, a new accelerator coaster from scratch that's actually taller than Red Force. So uh, Red Force is obviously the tallest uh, Giga coaster. Um, even though it's an accelerator coaster, it's still technically the tallest Giga. Um, so there is a possibility here and a real chance they could um, really go ahead and actually build an accelerator taller than Red Force. It would be the tallest coaster in Europe uh, and the tallest Giga in Europe. So I definitely think there's a real possibility here. If it's Zaton, then it won't be a record breaker. If it's a new one, it will be a record breaker. So it may not be the news article information that's wrong. It may be the coaster information that's wrong. So maybe it could be the Zaton or an Intimate Accelerator from scratch, or if the news article's wrong, then it could be just Zaton being relocated. I won't say the news article could be wrong, I think I say it'd be incorrect information. So I just wanted to bring that news update to you guys because I want to share my thoughts on it. You know, is it incorrect information? Is it not Zaton being relocated? Is it a new coaster from scratch? The only reason they picked up that it could be Zaton from Space World in Japan is the fact of that Google Earth image which you can find on the Coaster Force forum. Make sure you go and check it out. I'm sure other forums have got it as well. Um, and basically that whole image on Google Earth with Zaton's possible supports on site. Is it Zaton? Is it not? It's all about that. I think all the information from the articles and the rumours, it all relies on that particular question. Is it Zaton on Google Earth or is it a new coaster? So I think either way, Rush is getting a great coaster. Uh, and of course, the plan is to open it for 2020. So hopefully we'll get more details on it. And of course, any more details and it will be on the Europe coaster analysis uh, from what we know already. So uh, make sure you go stay tuned uh, for that video uh, during the new year. So thank you very much for watching this update on it. Like I said, we'll cover more updates on this when we get more correct information. Uh, and sort of confirm details and stuff like that. So uh, stay tuned for more updates on this. But thank you very much. Make sure you like the video if you loved it. Comment down below your thoughts down below. And also comment down below your shout outs for the next video. And also click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like the video if you loved it as well. Thank you very much. My name is Coaster Child. Keep on the coaster life. And I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care. Have an awesome day, my friends.